Hey friend, I'm going to help you learn how to create micro video content for social media. Best of all, you don't need this or this. All you need is this. This video could save you hundreds of hours in workflow and thousands of dollars in expensive equipment. Grab your cup of coffee, chill with me. There's a golden nugget at the end that's going to help you create content with almost no editing. If you're new here, I'm Matt, and this channel will bring you tips, tools, and tutorials for video creators who want to be more successful with video content marketing. All right, let's dig right in with some bonus tips to help you be more successful with your micro content. So what is micro video content? It's short and snappy content that's under a minute, sometimes two minutes, all the way up to a maximum of three minutes. I feel like if you're exceeding that duration of a video, then we're getting into longer form content. The challenge for creators delivering a message on camera is to stay on track and deliver a succinct and precise message in as few words as possible. So here are some tips to help you avoid rambling. Set one specific intention for every video before you press record. Get really clear about how you actually want to help and serve and support others. Write that down. If you press record and you're going on too long, narrow it down to a bite-sized chunk and eliminate the clutter. Your pacing may need to be a little bit faster than you usually record your videos at. Outline bullet points to stay on track unless you can speak faster than Speedy Gonzales. Underlay, underlay, aliva! Keeping your micro video below 60 seconds will give you the highest compatibility for the most amount of social media platforms. If you film in landscape, horizontal, 16 by 9, you can repurpose that video into a portrait video if you're standing center frame like I am. If you go portrait, vertical, you cannot repurpose that into a landscape video. Food for thought. Here are the five creative apps I recommend for creating micro content. For those of you creating at your desk, having a setup like this can save you a lot of time because there's little to no setup once you build it. You will find links to additional videos in the description below this video, so check that out when you're done watching it. In a moment, I'll show you how to record micro videos right at your computer and output a single video file even when you have multiple sources like a web camera, a pro camera, a cell phone, screen recordings, all into one video file. All right, first up, we've got the Camo application. Camo turns your iPhone or Android device into a webcam that's as close to pro camera quality you can get. What I love about this app is all the controls you get with the desktop application for PC or Mac and the consistent upgrades you get with the subscription, making it worth the investment. Next, we have the free to download and use OBS software for PC and Mac. By adding the Camo app to OBS, you can create micro videos quickly and you'll have the ability to capture screen recordings from your computer for free. OBS empowers you to create micro video content right at your computer with multiple sources and almost no edits. You can freestyle your content and you might even be able to get to a point where you can deliver your messages concise and without any editing. You can start a recording in OBS, pause it, you can stop it, you can switch sources all by pressing these buttons. Next up, if you've been a subscriber to the channel for a while, you know that I love the Filmic Pro app. There's an entire playlist of videos covering this app on the channel. Here's my top favorite features of Filmic Pro when it comes to creating micro video content. Filmic Remote, so you can see what you're doing and control your phone remotely with a tablet. Compatibility with electronic gimbals so you can capture buttery smooth footage with your phone. One of the best things you can do to make your videos more snappy and interesting is visual b-roll, which is visual shots that are overlaid on top of your main speaking video clips. You can actually create an uninterrupted b-roll sequence by using the Filmic Pro app with almost no edits. In a moment, I'm going to show you how to use the TikTok app even if you're not a TikToker and you don't want to do any dancing videos. I'm going to show you how to use this application to create micro video content with almost no editing. But first, let's check out Clipscribe. Clipscribe automatically generates captions for you. You can stylize them with your branding. You can add graphics and different elements to your videos with this simple and easy to use tool. Let me know in the comments which one of these applications are your favorite or which one you're most excited to try out. All right, check this out. We're going to use the TikTok app to create a micro content video with almost no editing. And we're going to eliminate the problem with that pesky watermark. All right, we're going to open up the TikTok app. 
we're gonna go to the plus symbol at the bottom and we're gonna go to on the bottom it says quick switch to camera Let's give yourself a 60 second timer and then basically all you're gonna do here is tap the record button and record your very first clip it could be short and sweet just one line three tips to be more successful with building a YouTube community tap the check mark here on the right so if you're playing multiple characters and you're doing an edutainment style video, you can switch your clothes out, you can put your different costumes on and record your whole video and you can add green screen effects. It's pretty cool. So now how do we get it out of this application without any watermarks? Great question. Let's check it out. So we're going to tap the check mark here when we're done and we're going to go to next and we're going to save it to drafts. Next you're going to need a screen recording app on your phone. So what you'll do is you'll start your screen recording and make sure the microphone is turned on. That way it actually captures the audio from your TikTok clip. So we'll open up the TikTok app. We'll go to drafts, bring up the draft and play it with sound. So when you're done, just stop your screen recording and it's going to save a video clip into your photos app. Now you can open up the photos app and pull up the video screen recording that you just created. And you can now edit this by tapping edit. You can scroll to the part where you have the video clip and then you can actually crop it to get rid of these elements on the side of the screen here. You can actually set your aspect ratio nine by 16 and then just drag this in. Boom. Thanks for the TikTok tip, Alex B. Sheridan. Go and check out this guy's channel because he's going to be pioneering this edutainment marketing space and you're going to see some really cool and entertaining and fun videos on his YouTube channel. Some of you may want to learn more about video editing with this super simple video editing software. I'm going to have a tutorial right up here for you getting started with Premiere Rush because I've found this application to be super simple for editing micro video content. You can do graphics and sound effects and you can add all kinds of awesome stuff with very simple controls. So make sure that you check that video out when it's released on the channel. Thanks for watching friend and I'll see you back here on the channel in a future video.